guys, welcome back to my channel. If you would like to get ready with me today, please stay tuned. And I hope you enjoy seeing it all in HD. Oh my god, it worked. Oh my god, I've got a button that works. This isn't for dogs. I need to get ready, bud. I need to get ready now. He is so handsome and stunning and gorgeous and stinky. I got a new button and a new lens and new light and a backdrop. Uh, let's do some makeup. We're off to a good start. So I'm going to use my Too Faced Born This Way foundation, which I have been really liking actually. I got it a while ago and then I just didn't reach for it for a long time. So I've just been applying it haphazardly with my fingers. And then I'll blend out with the beauty blender. So you guys, how are you? How are you? It's been a little while. It's been a hot minute. Hot sick. I've not been here for the longest of times. I've been on the go uh, a fair a fair bit recently. Yeah, I'm just really excited because this is my first time trying out my new my new setup. Um, I basically what I've done is I've moved my makeup area completely out of um because it was in my living room uh, just there. I've moved out there and I have like, behind the camera is my kitchen. But I've got a really weirdly big kitchen and I don't really cook that much so we never use the space. Um, we had to get rid of the kitchen table which made me a bit sad because I do like eating food at the kitchen table. So I don't know if you remember but I broke my camera lens the longest time ago. I just replaced that lens like two days ago. Um, I came home to a parcel and it had my lights in it which are two soft lights now i used to have my ring light but i broke my ring light as well um i've got two soft boxes either side of the camera um and then i bought a, a backdrop but um this is a blanket this is drop this is drogba's blanket actually it's quite mad it's just like a backdrop holder so it's like a big metal stand and you just clip your your backdrop onto it um so i got that as well and I got a proper tripod for my camera so it doesn't fall and break because that's what happened last time. This is a test, this is a trial run. And we're going to see how this setup is. If you have any constructive criticism, please do tell me. And if you've got, if you think it's great, please, please, please tell me. But yeah, we're just doing our makeup today. I'm going to, I hope you're doing your makeup because this is a get ready with me, which means that you're meant to be getting ready as well. So basically I came home and I don't know if you guys ever get this, but when I've been travelling... And I've been staying in hotels or like Sam's flats really nice and like minimalist. So I came home and obviously threw out everything. So everything, I put everything in the bin, everything in the trash. I've started moving stuff around because we're hopefully going to be getting this flat done up really soon. So the less possessions the better. So I've just been throwing everything away. Yeah, I really like this foundation actually. I don't know why I didn't at first. But to be fair, I didn't put it on with the beauty blender. I don't know what if that's the usual for this foundation but it's been treating me nicely another thing that I do now you might have seen this on Sam's video but the Kat Von D translucent powder when I first got this I just tried it out and it's my favourite so I just get my dark beauty blender and then and I have seen every single youtuber on earth do this before and I don't know why I just didn't do it but it makes the world a difference my face does not move I watched a couple of great videos this morning there was one that was Jenna Marbles and it was 30 things she learned in 30 years and it was hilarious. Um, but it wasn't only just funny, it was actually really, it was nice. So yeah, I watched that and then I watched Helen Anderson, she's a YouTuber from the UK. Um, I watched her video on body confidence and I thought it was amazing. I thought it was really great. Um, it was basically, basically was just saying, I do recommend you just go and watch that. But she was basically just saying um, the only the only reason she started thinking about her body or feeling kind of negative towards herself and her own body was because of other people and social media, obviously. And it's just it's just nice to kind of think sometimes that your body doesn't define you at all. You, it's your personality, it's you, the way that you are yourself. They just really picked me up, and I was. I also watched American Horror Story, obviously. I'm actually going to spray my face. I bought this new thing in Sephora. It's the Caudalie Beauty Elixir. And I got it because Luster Luxury is a bit. Katie. 
I'm just dusting that powder away just now. I can't, I really, I'm not very good at sitting with that on forever. It annoys me. So I just dust it away. And then I like to use this just to get the matte look away. So nice. So I think I'm just going to do something pretty easy. Sorry if you came here for a uh, in-depth tutorial. I'm home this week, which is really nice. Um, me and Jack are just getting some some family time in before I leave again. So on Sunday, so today's Monday. On Sunday, I'm going. I'm just going to use my Ultimate Bay palette. Don't mind me. On Sunday, I'm going to Belfast, which is fun. I love Belfast so much. I cannot wait to eat food. I'm really excited to go over. I'm doing a masterclass in a academy over there, which will be fun. And then I'm home for a night. I stay there for a night, then I get home. I'm home for a night. And then the next day I fly out to Los Angeles to um, hang out with Too Faced, which I'm so excited about. I can't do that with a nice face. It feels wrong. I feel like I need to do this. I'm going to use a really warm shade from Anastasia actually and my new favourite thing to do is just to use warm colours just right on the outside. Mmm, nice. Ugh, oh, looks like I'm doing another warm smoky eye! And I've got a list of videos that I really want to get made but if you guys have any ideas I would love to hear them. And then obviously Halloween, I have to do something for Halloween this year. I've got some really nice fluttery lashes I'm going to use today as well. I think that would look... Just fine. I think I'm going to ask Jack on a date tonight. There's loads of stuff out in the cinema, so I'm going to wait till he comes home and then say, <laughs> "Do you want to go to the cinema with me?" Let's see what he says. I'll let you know on Twitter. I would like to know what people's opinions are on American Horror Story. Also, I am not sure. Okay, I need to put mascara on. Still vibing this mascara. It's the million volume million lashes, the L'Oreal one. It's amazing. The only thing I will say about it is that it's got a plastic brush so when you poke yourself in the eye it actually is the sorest thing ever. Right, let's try and get these lashes on. Also, I have no nails on, I'm so aware you don't need to say anything. I'm getting them done tomorrow. The one thing I do love about not having nails on is how easy it is to apply lashes. Let's fix these eyebrows, they are crazy. I probably should have plucked them beforehand. And obviously elongate them as long as possible. Like that is just so much better and it took two seconds. And then something I've really been loving is getting my little brush. This is just the Smith brush. It's the 203. Teeny, teeny, tiny little angle brush. And I'm just going to bring the front of the brows down quite a lot. Like see when I feel like they start lower down it makes the arch look higher. All my stuff smells like Lush. I have to say, you guys, you should be pretty excited about Christmas at Lush this year. Everything looks so good. We ended up with too much stuff to bring home in our cases, so um, my stuff's getting shipped to me. It's getting mailed. So as soon as I've got it in, I'm going to do a little haul of my favourite things, I think. Let me know if that's a good idea or not. I thought it'd be pretty cool. So it, takes me, it doesn't take me that long at all, I think. To be honest, they're quite slapdash these days. Um, I just fling them on because I like them being so bushy anyway and feral looking. I don't really care if they're like super neat and tidy. I'm just great. As for contour, I've been doing it slightly lighter, not for any other reason than I have been. Um, so I'm going to use these two here from the Shayla palette from Tarte. Mix them together. Just a little touch right at the back. And then what I like to do is just get my bronzer with my Smith 112 brush, the famous 112 brush. And I'm just going to go around the tip of my nose. Highlight! Uh, I'm actually going to use the Sheila palette again. Let's use the highlight in the Sheila palette. I've been really liking this actually. So look how pretty is that? It is really, really nice. And it's just so easy because it's all in the one palette. And then I've just been using my finger to go my cupid's bow. And then once I've done my little tin man nose, I just go over that with my beauty blender and just pat that in. 
now I don't know what to do with my lips. Who knows? Nudes. Okay, I'm going to use a Tarte lip paint. This is the colour Grunge, so it's quite a dark brown. Do I have a lip liner? Post. Tarte, 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 Tarte. Ah, oh, it's Christmas! How exciting. So Tarte just sent me their Christmas stuff. So this is all their Tarteiest uh, gel liners. There's a really cute set with their lip paints. So it's got eight of their lip paints. And then four blushers with a wee brush. Wow. Christmas come early. I feel bad because these are all actual presents. Like they say in the back to from, so I feel like I should actually give them to people. Which would be a nice thing to do, wouldn't it? I'm going to use Nighthawk liner from Urban Decay. And then we're going to use Grunge lip paint by Tarte. And I think this is going to be really nice. This is going to be so nice. Okay, this is darker than I thought, but we're going to go with it. So, this lip, this lip colour is stunning, but the lip liner was far too light. Which is my fault. Wow. And because I've already baked my face, I'm not actually going to use any powder. I'm just going to use more of a spray. Oh, I... So you guys, that is me finished. Um, I hope you liked this video. I hope that I caught you up somewhat. And I'll see you next time. Clack, 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 clack. Pretend that my nails are clacking together. Clack, 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 clack.